Hey Summit, this is Edward and you know Jake. Hey, we are so excited about the last couple of weeks of what's going on at Summit. Uh, man, getting to meet together, be in the building, first service, second service, just hearing you guys sing out there. And so- Some of you some of you better than others. Yeah, true, true. But I'm, uh, even the bad ones I've enjoyed. I mean- I'm uh, one of the bad ones. Which is why we don't sit by each I'm other. I'm one of the bad uh, ones. But anyway, we, it's been really cool. The stories we've been hearing from adults to children to our youth, and then having those babies in the room and uh, just all the stuff that's going on with that. Uh, I'm excited and uh, I think we've got some exciting days ahead of us. The summer is uh, on us and uh, it's gonna be interesting to see what happens this summer. You, you know, Jake, one of the things I've loved uh, seeing is all those people serving, uh, you know, cleaning and between the services and all those things happening. And man, that is just so stinking cool. Yeah, we've been averaging uh, the last two Sundays, we've been averaging 38 volunteers a Sunday. Wow. And I'm just, I'm so happy to be a part of a church that likes to serve. But I also want to extend an invitation if you're watching this video today, I, as the leader of First Impressions, could use some help. And so if you're out there and you've never served and you want to uh, get in and help during this time of social distancing and phase one, phase two reopenings, I could use some help on First Impressions. It's really easy. Send me an email at jake at summitheightsfellowship.com and I'd love to put you on the team uh, so that we can greet people and make people feel welcomed as they come into the building. You remember a couple weeks ago we talked about that test drive when, yep. I, when I sold cars. Mm -hmm. This is a great way to test drive first impressions if you're just been kind of thinking about it and they really don't want to make a long-term commitment yeah. but maybe hey, you know you can test drive this for a couple of weeks and just see and and Jake will put you on a schedule and this be, this is a great time yeah. to do that and kind yeah. of jump in on that kind of right. stuff so so I got something else yep yep no I got something else okay. this is very Good. very important so Good. you know you know those times that you've had to call me into your office and, and you say you're not in trouble Jake but yeah, that's and like every Tuesday. Yeah, and so yeah. every anytime Edward calls me into the office and says, you're not in trouble, Jake, but, I mean, that but, I, I feel like I'm in trouble. Uh, so, uh, but listen, nobody's in trouble, but. Okay. I want to encourage you guys out there to do us a favor. You know, communication's been, been a challenge yeah. during COVID. Yeah. It's been a challenge during social distancing. Which is why we're doing these. Which is why yeah. we're doing the videos. And so we encourage you to watch the entire video we encourage you to please, please, please sign up for those text alerts. And share this video. Yeah. Share this video. Right now, share this video. We encourage you to get on that email chain if we have your valid email. If we don't, send us one so that you can get those PDF hey, bulletins. Hey, are, are you one of those people that leave unopened emails on your desktop and on your phone that has the bubble? No, my wife is, though. She's so, got like 1,167 unopened emails. That is so emails. annoying. I know. You know, I mean, you open do your something. email. You got to I mean, do something. Open your email, She's your employee dude. to do something with her. You got to open no. them. But seriously, <laughs> um, that's where you're going to get information because there's a lot of things kind of revolving as we're moving yeah. closer and closer and closer into this, you know, big reopening. Uh, our children's ministry is, has moved their Zooms to Wednesday. Our youth ministry is now alternating. Back they're back on campus on Wednesday night, but they're doing one week uh, senior high, one week junior high. Uh, there's links that go out. There's uh, crafts and, and things to be picked up for preschool. And the best way for you to keep up with everything going on are these videos, our text alerts, and our email bulletins. You gotta open that email though. You gotta open the email. So you're not in trouble, <laughs> but. You gotta open the email, yeah. man. Uh, you gotta read it. I yeah. mean, uh, you know, anyway, hey, we're really excited about what's going on. The elders are meeting next Wednesday, and uh, we'll be discussing phase two. Uh, not sure when that's gonna happen or how that's gonna happen at this point. Uh, even what's going to be in phase two. Will it involve a three-legged pug? Uh, no, but there's one right laying okay. right there. Right. So uh, <laughs> you want to show them? Yeah. Yep. Three-legged pug. Welcome. This is Peggy. Uh, she's part of our family that lives here in our backyard. She has three legs. And so uh, we love her. And she's in the video every week. Just this first time we've shown her. So All right. uh, we're excited. We can't wait to see you and see you this Sunday. Um, we love you. And we look forward to uh, what's going to happen this Sunday. So have a great week.